All right, journal entry number seven. And boy, do I have a video for you guys this week or myself. I, like I said, I watch my videos all the time. I'm always trying to learn about something. And I just learned I cannot make a video without a script. Script? Uh, I tried something new and I think my video is still good, but it was a lot harder to, I feel like, keep that quality that I'm used to in myself. And yeah, I'm never doing that again. I'm gonna plan my stuff out and I think I kind of know how to move forward, I guess, with uh, how I go about making my scripts, uh, what kind of works for me. But yeah, um, I feel like there's a lot that was going on in my mind this week. Um, first of all, I did join like this Facebook YouTube creators group and I think that's really cool. I think it's great to try to get to know a few people that are on the same kind of path or journey as you and seeing what they're doing and what you know works for them and seeing what works for you. And um, I will say, <laughs> me being me, uh, I got overwhelmed. Uh, I think there's a reason why <laughs> Uh, I'm being super honest now. I think there's a why, there's a reason why, dang, uh, why, I'm just, all right, I'm butchering stuff now. There is a reason why I stayed away from YouTube for so much, or for so long, and it's because, uh, maybe intimidation? Uh, the, the idea that maybe I'm not good enough. I see all these people doing their thing, and I think they're great. Uh, I see these people with like even a thousand subscribers or 500 subscribers and I start to compare myself to them and it's nobody's fault but my own. Uh, I think that's a shortcoming of mine and I think it's good to recognize that because I want to fix that. I want to, I want to tell myself like I don't need to compare myself to others. I'm, I, I'm happy for them. I'm like, it's honestly... It's really cool to see people doing the same thing I'm doing. But at the same time, it's also, in my mind, I'm a perfectionist. I want to be just as good as somebody else at what I'm doing. Um, not to compete, but just like, you know, I want to I wanna get there too. <laughs> and I know I will. I, I'll get there, but I got to go at my own pace. And I need to learn to stop comparing myself to others and just use them as inspiration to push me to go harder um like I said I'm very passionate in this uh project now and I'm not gonna stop and I want to look back at these videos and see how far I've come and I know there's gonna be people that help me along that way and indirectly these people these uh content creators that I'm a part of in a group they're gonna help me and the the overwhelming part there's there's a lot to learn it it can be a little scary actually i think that's another reason why i stopped doing youtube uh, back in the day was because i got scared uh there's a lot of stuff that i'm going to have to learn and i just need to accept that whether that's uh making content uh thumbnails algorithms how to get attention blah 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 boring stuff but there's like a whole different world to making content and yeah it like fried my brain I got pretty nervous but I don't want to talk myself out of it I'm gonna hold myself accountable and that's something I didn't do before when I say I'm gonna do something I'm gonna do it no matter what whatever it takes and I just want to show myself that I want to show myself that if I'm stuttering a lot it's because I'm I'm I don't know how to express my feelings. I get, I get nervous, I guess, and I start stuttering. So yeah, you're seeing the real deal firsthand. And uh, I hope you can appreciate that if you're watching this. Like I said, I make my journal entries for me, kind of like talking to myself. That's why I'm so informal, but yeah, YouTube. Oh, I did buy something new. Well, my dad helped me with, for my birthday. He helped me buy something to maybe make the quality in my videos a little bit better. So I don't have to keep using DVDs <laughs> and prop my phone. Uh, so I'm going to try using that 
and see what happens. And uh, I kind of know what next steps I need to take to help make my content better or help me get in that mindset of making better content and really hunkering down and, you know, moving forward. I really, I really do want to move forward. I love doing this. Secretly, I do love doing this. And uh, I do also know I need to start, if I want to start making better content and really setting time aside for it, I need to switch up when I sit down. The The time frame I give myself to actually work on this is not working. <laughs> and I need to change that. So, Mr. Smith, change it. I I know what I'm going to try doing. I just want to make sure you're going to do it. But yeah, uh, I think that's it for this week. Nothing crazy. Well, I always say that. But I have fun making these and I'll keep making them. But yes, thank you for watching. And I will catch you all next week or in the next journal entry. Yeah, something like that. We rolling with it. We'll figure it out along the way. Just enjoying the, the journey. All right, catch you later.